Plenty of people are taking pictures on their cell phones, but that doesn't mean that the camera is going anywhere. I'm here with Terry Sullivan, one of our electronics editors, to talk about what we might see at the upcoming Consumer Electronics Show when it comes to cameras. Terry, tell me a little bit about how we're seeing cameras evolve. Well, cameras are evolving by including the technology that's in smartphones. That means you can download an app, edit it right on your uh, phone, so crop it or do whatever, and then post it directly on Facebook or any social networking site. The Samsung takes that a step further by including uh, a wireless technology, 3G and 4G, that's on your phones, so you have greater access even. And we expect to see more of these Android uh, type of cameras at uh, CES. Now, what's all this Wi-Fi access doing to the battery life of these cameras? That's uh, something that uh, is going to tax your, your, your camera, and it's going to drain the battery pretty quickly. So we're uh, planning on seeing more uh, cameras that do this more efficiently at CES. And when it comes to Zoom, it seems like Zoom just continues to expand. Is that the case? It's very much the, the, the case. Uh, for instance, this Canon, um, it has a 50 times optical zoom. So that is 50 times zoom. That's 24 millimeters, which, you know, you can take the Grand Canyon, a huge vista, and then zoom way into 1,200 millimeters, which, you know, is great for sports shooting and getting your, your kids on, on film you can even shoot the moon on this sort of camera and see even the craters on the moon. It's really incredible. And we expect to see more large zoom, super zoom type of cameras. Is there even a market for camcorders anymore? Camcorders got particularly hurt by the improvements in smartphones and how they take video. But these both can go where you wouldn't want to take a smartphone. Uh, for instance, in, in the water with these waterproof cases, or particularly with skiing, where there's water and there's also the ability to drop them. So they need to be rugged. And these both in their casings become really rugged types of cameras. And it's great footage of, you know, you going down the mountain right on your helmet. So they're, they're really exciting uh, types of camcorders that are taking place with these. And we expect to see more of these types also at CES. Thanks so much, Terry. Thank you, Amber. Make sure and join us for our complete coverage from the floor of CES, where we'll show you the latest and greatest developments in the world of cameras. I'm Amber Tentoff for Consumer Reports.